Hey guys, welcome back to Magic TV. My name's Craig, it's six o'clock, it's time for a Magic Live. Today I'm gonna to be doing a routine that I perform in almost every kid's show I do, every family show I do. This routine is in there. I also perform it um, uh, quite often in cabaret, but in a slightly different way. Um, but a lot of people have been wanting more routines on the Netflix to do with kids' shows. So this is my closer a lot of the time for my kids' show. It always gets a killer reaction. And I'm teaching it and everything to do with it on the Netflix. Um, yeah, on the Netflix. It's, 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 it's there, Monday. It might have already gone up by the time you watch this. Yeah. It will have done. Michael said it's on there now. So go check it out. It's, uh, I honestly think it's worth the price of the Netflix alone with the amount of times I've performed it. Um, Jack. We can do a trick. I've worked here nearly four years, and how does stuff like this surprise me? Well, there you go. <laughs> Jack, I'm going to show you something amazing, all right? You are going to be the star of the show. Oh, Christ. Now, in order to be the star of the show, there's a few things that you need to learn. There's three moves that you need to learn, okay? We're going to go through the three moves. The first move is you take your hands and you do this. Face the front. You're in show business right now. So move number one, you do this. Very good. Move number two, you take your foot and you do this. Wonderful. And the final move is a big, loud voice. You go, ta-da! Ta-da! Now you put all three of those together, you get this. Ta-da! Ta-da! That's amazing. Now that, in the industry, we call that an applause cue. When you do that, it tells the audience they've got to clap and cheer loudly. Watch this. Ta-da! Thank you. But you do it, they'll be 20 times louder. If there was an audience. Go for it. Ta-da! Don't knock everything over. That was great. Well done, Jack. Well Thanks, done. Mark. Well done. <laughs> so, and now you're ready. Do me a favour, face me. Uh, put your fingers like this. Very good, I'm just gonna take the toilet roll and put it here, put your fingers in. Congratulations, Jack, you're a toilet roll holder. Hooray. Nice. Now we're gonna do something absolutely amazing with the toilet roll. We only need a little bit of the toilet roll. Here we go, a little bit for uh, me. Put that, uh, don't move, thank you. Right there for a minute. And we need a little bit more toilet roll and that goes right there. Wonderful, so you can let go now. Excellent, we'll put that back over there. So we have two sheets of toilet paper. I don't got partner for this. No, you don't. <laughs> one sheet for you, one sheet for me. About the same size. It's you okay. hold on to yours, I'll hold on to mine, and you're gonna copy everything I do. Okay. So hold it and copy everything I do. Copy everything I do. Very good, well done. well done. Right, step number one, show the paper to the audience. Very good. Now what you have to do is wave it up and down like this. Very good, now take it back into this position. Let me do it first to show you what to do and then you can try it. You're gonna take the toilet paper, rip it in the middle a little bit there, and then go, go right down the middle into two completely not equal pieces at all. Uh, rip it like that, but do not, under any circumstances, do it better than me. Oh, do not do it any better. I hate you. <laughs> Put the pieces together like this, very good. Now let me show you first of all, because I am after all a professional ripper of a pop up up a professional ripper. I rip paper for a living. Here's what you do. You take the paper. You want to rip it up into a million billion pieces. You want to rip it up into a thousand gajillion million squidgillion pieces until you've got all these pieces. And then at that point, you squidge it into a little ball so it's nice and tight. Go ahead, do the ripping. And actually, make yourself a little bit like a superhero. Put it in your hand like this. Okay, go for it. You're doing well. Keep, keep going. It's going great. Rip it up. Very good. I've got bigger hands than you, use two hands. Yeah. Excellent. So the idea is very simple. I'm gonna put your paper back together. You're gonna to put my paper back together. I am a professional, so I will do, I'll do it first and then you can copy me. Now to put the paper back together, it's very simple. It's the move that I taught you. Watch, I just do this, ta-da! Now that will have all gone back together. Open it up and show them it's all gone back together and I will get a big round of applause for being so clever. Seriously, open it up, Jack. Show them it's all gone back together and I will get a big round of applause for being so unbelievably... I don't think it has. Is it? Yeah, put it back in your hand. Um, I didn't ta-da loud enough. Let me try that again. Hang on. Ta-da! There it is. Open it up and show them it's all gone back together. And I'll get a huge round of applause for being so unbelievably... Has it gone? Uh, no. Just check it on the floor. Um, in my defence, it's very difficult to do what I just tried to do. If I can't do it, there's no way you could do it. That's fair enough. But I think you should try. But I'm going to make it 20 times harder for you. I'm going to put my paper in my mouth. Now when I do that, don't try this at home. It's I'd disgusting, I'd yeah. <laughs> go around your mates house, you won't get in trouble. Now here's the thing, I'm gonna put it in my mouth, okay? Now when I do, I'm not gonna be able to speak. So it's very important, the idea is I'm gonna to point to you. You're gonna go, ta-da, 
I'll then point to the audience and the audience will cheer, whoop, holler as loud as they can. That's you, Michael. If you go to dar as loud as you can, as, as fast as you can, as quickly, as most impressively as you can, if the audience is as loud as they can be, this will go back together into one piece. Are you ready? Yeah. That's not good enough. Are you ready? Yeah. Audience, are you ready? Yeah. They sound so excited. Here we go. It's disgusting. Mmm. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm. 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 I can't go that high pitched. It's the longest I've been quiet for. <laughs> that is absolutely disgusting. But he did it. Give Jack a huge round of applause. Amazing. So that's the studio performance of it. It's uh, you know it's it's a paper tear really with a uh, with a. Um, mouth coil finish but it's it's honestly gets the most insane reactions uh when you perform it in the family show or in the kids show and you'll see live performance footage of it on the netrix as well uh so you can see exactly how it plays at a gig uh if you want to learn it you can go to the netrix now www.thenetrix.com you can go see all the fuss is about and why everyone's signing up and i will see you again soon thank you so much for watching my name's craig for magic tv mm.